Today, teacher will discuss comprehensive practice question number seven. Diagram one shows the distance time graph of car A for a period of t seconds. It is given that the average speed of car A is 25 meter per second. Calculate the value of t. As we know, the formula for average speed is equals total distance over total time taken. So from this graph, total distance is here 1 kilometer plus return trip 1 kilometer. So total distance is 2 kilometers. We will write it as 25 equals, you need convert the kilometer to meter. So 2 times 1000 over the total time taken is T. 25T equals 2000. T equals 2000 divided by 25. T equals a T. 2. Describe the motion of car A for the period of T seconds. When we describe the motion of car, we need to have distance, time, and speed or average speed. So you write the answer like this. Car A moves with an average speed of 25 meter per second for a distance of 2 kilometers in 80 seconds. B. Diagram 2 shows the speed time graph of car B. It is given that the uniform speed V of car B is the same as the average speed of car A and both vehicles travel the same distance. If the values of T in seconds for the both graphs are the same, calculate the duration in minutes during which car B move at a uniform speed. This part is the duration of the car move in uniform speed. I label it as T. And also from the question, given that the uniform speed V of the car B is the same as the average speed of car A. So V equals 25 meter per second. From the question, value of t in second for both graphs are the same. So just now we already found the, the value of t equals a t. So for this one, t plus 20 is a t plus 20 equals 100. Both vehicles travel the same distance. So means that the area under the graph here is equals 2 km. To find the duration which car move at a uniform speed, we need to form an equation. So total distance equals 2000 meter. So area under the graph here, this is a trapezium. So 1 over 2 times the sum of two parallel lines. Here is the parallel lines. So here the best is 100 plus T times the height is 25 equals 2000. So this one we simplify it 12.5 and we expand the bracket. 100 times 12.5 equals 1250 plus 12.5 times t equals 12.5 t equals 2000. So we will move this number to the right hand side. 12.5 t equals 2000 minus 1250. 12.5 T equals 750. T equals 
750 divided by 12.5. P equals 60. So the unit is in seconds because P equals meter per second. So now the question asks you write the answer in minutes. So you convert the second to minutes. So T equals 1 minute.